It's just really good stuff. I mean, people use it. Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today I am filming a tag video and these usually go down quite well because they're more kind of get to know me style videos. And this is a brand new tag which was created by Dale, my beautiful friend from Monster Makeup XX. I will have her linked down below and I will also link her channel here. So I highly recommend you check her out. She is just hilarious and I love her accent and she's gorgeous. And yeah, basically she's got the whole package. So Dale kind of came up with these tag questions and I think they're really, really good and they're really focused on the Irish beauty YouTuber community as opposed to just the Irish YouTuber community, which was very, very broad. But this is more towards us kind of makeup and beauty kind of gals. So the first question is, what is your YouTube name? My YouTube name is My Makeup Perspective. Sometimes I regret picking that name because I'd like to have my name maybe in my... Um, YouTube username but I mean it's okay and my channel is doing okay so I actually well some days I don't like it some days I really do number two how long are you on YouTube this is kind of a weighted question I started a YouTube channel maybe five years ago more six years ago and that was called Miss Luscious Laura and I uploaded videos there and that, that channel actually did quite well but I just hated the username it just sounded like I loved myself like Miss Luscious Laura hello I love me what's your hobby I called it a day on that YouTube channel and I started my makeup perspective and I used it just to subscribe to people up until I think November last year when I said you know what I need to start making videos again I really liked that so I started making videos again so I've been on YouTube for six years but my channel has only been uploading videos since November last year. Oh, quick side note. I was thinking of going back and taking some of my old videos, which are still on my old channel, they're just on private, and maybe re-uploading them so you could see what I looked like six years ago. Um, there's one video in particular where I went from really long hair to really short hair. Let me know if you'd be interested in me re-uploading that because I think it could be fun. Number three, your favorite Irish brand. And this is gonna be a bit maybe surprising to some people, but my favorite Irish brand is Sudocrem. Who doesn't know about pseudo? Is it pseudo cream or pseudo creme? I always thought it was pseudo cream, and my mommy's a nurse, so she would know, right? Um, and my boyfriend is like, no, it's pseudo creme. So it's this brand. What Irish household does not have a tub of this? If you have a cup of tea and this stuff, my mom thinks you are good to go. If you came in with your leg hanging off, she would pop some of this on and you'd be right as rain. Out to go, back out to play. I mean, people use this for everything. Nappy rash for babies, obviously that's its primary use. Eczema, bed sores, sunburn, minor burns, surface wounds, acne, chillblains. I mean, you can use this on anything. I love it. And I probably use it, like if I have little nicks or cuts or anything, I will often use this on them and it heals them up in record time. This was, I actually Wikipedia this yesterday just to make sure it actually is an Irish brand. And yes, it is. It was originally called Smith's Cream back in the day and the man who invented it was in Dublin and it's now manufactured, I think, in England. But it is an Irish brand. Question number four is my favourite Irish YouTubers. <sighs> See, I always feel such pressure with these kind of questions and when I'm tagging people, I always leave people out and I feel so bad. I'm gonna make this a quick fire round. Naked Without My Lippy, Monster Makeup XX, Fits and Bits, Lovely Girly Bits, Dolly Rouge, Let's Make Up, Little Kiva, Makeup Over Mind, <laughs> Crazy For Makeup 112, Melanie Murphy, Faces by Grace 23, She Be Beauty. There are just so many Irish YouTubers. I literally feel so pressured right now trying to remember them all. But literally, there is not one Irish beauty YouTuber that I have watched that I have been disappointed in. And that's like, I know it sounds like a cop out, that is legit. I literally, when I find a new one, I'm like, ah, subscribe, because I love them so much. Number six, the Irish YouTuber that inspires you. I think every Irish YouTuber has little, like little things that kind of inspire me. Like some YouTubers are just so dedicated and they upload so regularly and I'm like, oh, that's really inspirational. And some are just really dedicated to like really good editing. And I'm like, that's really inspirational too. So it's really hard to pick one. There are some YouTubers that are just go-getters. And I think everyone has something to offer. And I don't want to name one person as inspiring me because I could literally go through every single Irish YouTuber and say, yeah, she inspired me because of this. He inspired me because of this. She inspires me because of this. Everyone has their own kind of unique things that inspire me. Some people are, you know, mothers who upload to YouTube. And I think that's just 
amazing. I don't know how I would cope if I had a child and I had to continue making videos for YouTube. Some people work crazy long hours and still manage to upload to YouTube. Some people spend hours and hours and hours editing, which I don't, by the way. I literally sit down, put it into Movie Maker, clip out the bits that where I'm cursing or if I'm farting or whatever, and up it goes, whatever. I just think everyone is inspirational in their own way and everyone is fighting their own battles at home and uploading to YouTube, everyone thinks it's so easy, but it's not. So having the bravery to come before a camera and having the stamina to keep like, to be able to do, like live a life as well, I think it's quite inspirational. Have I gone way off on a tangent? Am I on drugs? Basically, everyone inspires me. Number seven, what brand would you like to see come to Ireland? has to be Tarte. It's a really good vegan and cruelty free brand. The products use a lot of natural ingredients and they're meant to be really good for the skin. And I have used some of their products before and I have enjoyed them and I would like to see them come to Ireland. So Tarte, if you're watching, unlikely, please come to Ireland. Number eight, Duns or Pennies. And if you're not Irish, you won't know what we're talking about. But if you are Irish, you will know exactly what we're talking about. And there's pros and cons for both. Pe I mean, Pennies is amazing for up-to-date fashion and reasonably priced fashion, but Duns sells food. But if we're going by the clothes section, I'd have to be a Pennies gal. And everyone is saying Pennies, so I kind of want to give Duns my vote, but I can't because that would be a lie. I would pick Pennies. And finally, number nine, the best thing about being Irish is... Everyone kind of said the same thing, but in different ways. And I'm going to say it again. It's like we're known for our friendliness and our niceness. And everyone loves our accents except for ourselves. <laughs> Everywhere we go around the world, people are like, "Ah, oh, you're Irish. Yeah. People, like it's seen as a really good thing. Um, and I'm not sure if like if I was Scottish, would I be met with the same? I don't know because I'm not Scottish, but I find people just are really, really friendly when they hear you're from Ireland and everyone's heard of it and everyone wants to be Irish. You hear people like all over the world saying, oh my, you know, great, great, great granddad was a quarter Irish and they're like, yeah, I'm part Irish. And I'm going, mm, okay. <laughs> like, and that's like, that's not a big deal. I don't think that's a bad thing. People just really, really want to have Irish roots. And I think that's really, really cool. So that's my tag video. I'm going to tag everyone down below who you should be subscribed to. Um, so check out my information box and I hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give me a thumbs up. Leave me a comment if you have any video requests and I will talk to you in my next video. Bye everyone.